Hi, this is how to find a parasitic battery drain on a vehicle. You just disconnect the cable. Sorry about that. You just disconnect the cable from the negative battery terminal. And then you hook up a multimeter to it. Let me turn that on. You hook up a multimeter to the cable that you disconnected and the battery terminal. And then make sure it's on DC volts. And then on milliamps. And then you should see if you have a drain. Now, right now it's not showing I have a drain because I know what it is. But in order to find out what the drain is, you just disconnect a refuse until you the drain goes away. If it doesn't go away, see so there's a drain right there. Now, say you disconnected all your fuses. You tried disconnecting one by one and it didn't work and you just took them all out and it still didn't work. So you know for sure it's not the fuses. As you can see, I'm missing some fuses there because I took out all the fuses. I have three fuses in right now. And, but I found out what my drain is. It's actually the alternator. This right here, this wire here is the alternator wire and when I connect it, when I connect it you will see the, the drain start, see? And when I disconnect it, it's gone. Completely gone. And that wire, if you follow it, you can't really see here too well, but it goes to the alternator right over here. There it is. That's the wire, that white wire. So I know for sure that the drain is coming from the alternator. It could also be your starter, and it could also be bad ground wires. So I wish you good luck, or I hope you good luck actually. I don't want to wish, but I hope you good luck in finding your problem. And uh, thanks for watching this video, and goodbye.